What's going on everybody? My name is Smoke, this is 563 Gaming, and welcome back to Subnautica! So yeah, today uh, I got a whole bunch of stuff planned for you guys, so uh, let's get right into it, shall we? Alright, so basically, um, you're gonna... I'm gonna turn around here and... Oh, look at that! I got a desk and a chair! My very own little office. Yeah! So, yeah, so, you know, I, I, uh, I'll show you guys where I got that stuff in a minute, but um, I want to take you in here, and I built up the aquarium two levels high, you gotta, I see some, you know, you guys gotta see, so I got some fish up in there, and, you know, uh, my creep vines, a uh, bunch of the, the acid mushrooms I've got growing in there, so, you know, I just have a... Uh, bunch of stuff going on in there that that particular guy right there the the ray looking one that actually hatched out of a creature egg that I found and I just threw in there so I thought that was pretty neat um, so anyway yeah um, let's open this up take that Wait. close it back up okay now before we go get exploring um, Got a couple things I wanted to to do. So, first and foremost, you see that I got three batteries here. Yes, three batteries because Sea Glide takes batteries, and we're gonna go on an adventure today. So, yeah, uh, I need. Where's the other lead? There they are. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one that one I think that's it so we'll get out of here open up our locker go to personal gonna go to equipment and radiation suit that's right I got I, I put in a ton of work off camera collected up everything I would need to make the radiation suit so we are no longer bound by those boundaries and not having to worry about getting over to uh, where the the Aurora is are getting closer, so now we can fully explore everywhere there is to explore. So let's go ahead and make that. All right, and then just check, make sure, and there it is. So we've got our radiation suit. Now, also. We're going to go into personal equipment and wiring kit. There. So I made the copper wire. I didn't make the wiring kit. Advanced wiring kit. Wiring kit. We need two silver ore for that. And I just so happen to have two silver ore. So let's go to resources, electronics, wiring kit. Hello, and then we're gonna go to tools. No, not tools. Equipment, and we're gonna make a rebreather. Hallelujah! All right. So now we are gonna go out of here. We're gonna pop that over here and pop that in there, because we're actually not gonna go into where the. Uh, uh, radiation is today. We'll get to that in another episode. But I wanted to make the radiation suit. I had everything collected up for it. I wanted you guys to see me make that. So, yeah, let's uh, let's get to it. Um, I'm gonna keep the radiation helmet on me in case we do run into radiation, because then I can quickly just swap out the rebreather for the radiation helmet. But the rebreather is going to help me, um, essentially, you know, stay longer under. Uh, the ocean so and of course it's getting nighttime right as I'm finishing all this stuff up so yeah that's a, that ought to be fun um, 
do, do, do. Oh, the other thing I did is I you know, I uh, I got a couple more pieces for the sea moth. We need to collect up two more, which is what we're going to be doing today. Um, I also found a part of the propulsion cannon blueprint, which is a a gun essentially, which is going to help immensely, especially in the more hostile areas. So, and then I finished off the getting the hull fragments for the cyclops so now i need to collect up the other pieces for the cyclops um and i don't know if i got anything else that was worthy of noting you know see i got the cyclops hull blueprint uh picked up a water filtration machine blueprint which will be nice to have if you know if we were uh, doing a survival mode where we had to eat and drink all the time but would not i also ended up with a getting a dive reel blueprint so when we start diving into some of these deeper areas and deeper caves i can actually connect that in go down and then wind myself back out of there with you know without having to use the sea glide or the um the sea moth once i get it so all right um, I think that covers everything I did off camera. Also, I mean, obviously, I'm sure you guys have noticed I've added a face cam. Um, I will be getting a green screen at some point in the next week or so. So once I get that, then you will not only see me and probably this. So um, that'll be pretty cool. You won't see all this stuff going on behind me. It'll just be, you know, the background, of, you know, the... The game in behind me, which would be pretty neat. So I'll have that set up within the next week or so. But uh, yeah, let's. What was I going to do? Oh yes, I'm gonna pop out here. Yeah, we're actually gonna go grab. Oh, and I forgot to. Hold on. Let's get up in here. I just want to grab another first aid kit because the area we're going to be going into is hostile. It's that same area where I got attacked in the last episode when I was going after the sea moth fragment. Or not last episode, the fourth episode. So, and let's open this bad boy up. And I'm going to just go ahead and drop that over there. Creature egg. I wonder what's in that creature egg, but oh well. Um, so yeah, we got four first aid kits now. We got our radiation helmet, three batteries. We've got everything that we might possibly need to survive. So let's get out of that. That's cool how it glows green like that underneath the, the base. It's pretty neat. So. We are going to head off in this direction here. How close do you think it is to daylight? So like I said, the area we're in is... We're going to be going into is relatively hostile, so... I don't know if I really want to be going down in it at night. We might have to wait till daytime. As a matter of fact, I know we're going to wait till daytime, so... Be right back. All right, guys, I'm back, and we are going to, uh, again, like I said, head off in this direction. So let's grab the Sea Glide, pop a battery into it, and let's go. Through the creepy creep vines here. Whoa! You see that thing? I'm not going any closer to it. Anyway, this is the area where I found all the sea moth fragments and everything. What the heck is that thing? 
Good God. I don't want to tangle with him. So what we got down here? Oh! Stupid biters. Alright, so one more sea moth fragment. Grab that. Shoot back up real quick. I found that. Whoa! Why is it getting so dark? It got super dark there for a second. I was like, uh, I know it just became daylight, so why, why, why? All right. So let's. Caution. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh, okay. Let's go up and get some oxygen. Do. -do, -do. I was under there for a while though, so the rebreather is helping. I also have four oxygen tanks now because when I was down here off camera, I noticed that I was having I was having to go way, you know, go back up a few times. I almost didn't make it a couple times because we're pretty we're pretty getting pretty deep down in here. Some of these areas, so let's fly around in here. I thought I saw something back this way though. Where is that thing? There it is. Keep my eyes on that thing for sure. Alright, what do we got here? Got some biters. What is this? Nice. Oh, you. Sons of guns. Alright. Give me that, because that's the last fragment that I need. Unlocked Seamoth. That is what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's get up. There's still a couple other things down down in this area I want to go look at. Um, like that propulsion cannon. That's something that I definitely want to look into getting. What's this? Bioreactor. Nothing I need. Is that salt? Yes, it is. I need some salt. Matter of fact, I needed a bunch of salt. So there we go. Got the salt that I needed. Cool. Alright, let's go up and grab some air real quick. Thing is ugly, isn't it? Nope. Get back up. Hey, don't don't be turning towards me. Ugly thing. Ooh. All right. Um. I was down here earlier. What's that? What is that? Oh, I bet that's a creature egg for one of them nasty suckers. I don't want that thing. Just eat all my fish, all my cool fish. Where's that big son of a gun? 
Alright, so yeah, there's a crash site over here of some sort. And I was kind of traipsing through it earlier. I think I've already picked it clean, but there might be something inside of it. it might be neat to get. I'm not sure if I can get inside of it. Looks like I can get in right there. Let's go up and grab some air real quick. Alright, back down we go. Ooh, is that a box? That is a box. Okay. Propulsion cannon. Yeah. Okay. I do want to go in this thing. But I also want a propulsion cannon, so... I think the uh, propulsion cannon takes priority. Then we'll go in that thing in a minute. So yeah, we're just scanning the area now, just looking for these boxes. Ooh, what's that? That's a cave. We'll have to explore that some other time. That's a Cyclops hull fragment, I found that earlier. Gotta keep our eyes out for the big dude. Is that a box? No, it's salt. Oh, I hear the big guy. There he is. I still don't know what those things are. Oh, oh you... Whoa! Whoa! Caution. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I almost ran right into that dude. Get up, 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 get up! Big sucker. Alright, real quick. Do that. Holy moly. Oh, that was a lot faster, too. Holy junk. Thing is huge. It's like mama and baby. Ooh. Where you at? Yeah. Okay. Alright. I'm getting the heck out of Dodge. I think we've uh, done enough exploring in this area for one day. So 
So, yeah. Get up on this bad boy. Alright, so we need a titanium ingot, a power cell, two glass, and lubricant. Alright. I think I can get a titanium ingot. And then... Power cell... I'm going the wrong way. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, so let's drop the salt. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Resources, basic materials, titanium ingot. Okay. Electronics. What do we need for a power cell? Two batteries and silicone rubber. How do you get silicone rubber? Oh yeah, seed clusters. Okay, that's easy enough. Boop. Let's drop off an O2 tank. We'll grab it before we ever head back out. Boop. One, two. Alrighty. there and silicone rubber electronics power cell one step closer and then we need what else was it Blueprints. Seamoth propulsion cannon too. Yeah, advanced wiring kit, battery, titanium. Okay. We gotta get gold for an advanced wiring kit. Right, we need two glass and lubricant. Okay. Got one quartz. Let's go out and grab some quartz real quick. I want to get this built before the end of the episode. I saw this on the way back, so I knew it was here. Another one up there, but I only need one, so. Oh wait, was it two glass? I think it was two glass. So we'll grab these just in case. Bloop. Bloop.
Materials, glass, glass, and lubricant was that. Can I fit three? Yeah, I can fit three. We we'll just need the lubricant, and then we can build the sea moth. Get out of my way. I got a sea moth to build. Resources, basic materials, lubricant. All right, let's go. do. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, we have a sea moth. All right, let's get in it, go for a test run. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, ho, 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 yeah, baby. Look at that. That is awesome. All right, guys. Uh, that's going to do it for today's episode. Um, as always, um, well, before I go, go into that, if you like the video, please hit that like button. Let's me know what I'm doing right. And, uh, yeah, as always, take it easy. Have fun. Later. Later.